saw you from the window. And it looked like you could use a wake-up call. I thought you moved to a hotel closer to the hospital. You still at the Inn at Bainbridge? Always, you know, with the mocking. <sighs> so, um, I was thinking that we could have sex tonight. <laughs> <laughs> Look, I know we're both gonna feel weird about it. And it's the first time since Mark and Meredith. I have the day off. Do you have the day off? I stopped by the hospital. I have patients I need to check on. If you have the day off, what are you doing here? Just thinking we can have sex tonight. Come on, I made a reservation at noon. I figure we can do the Thanksgiving thing, you know, and then... I don't know, just rip the stitches. Get it over with. No anesthesia. Right. What do you think? Med school. We spent Thanksgiving studying for exams, eating really bad Chinese food, so <laughs> turkey. Yeah, too busy and too tired to even think about cooking. We never had to schedule sex. Not once. Derek, I want to get through this. I do. I want things to be normal again, like it used to be. So will you meet me at noon? Yeah, okay, I'll see you. Hey, Chief. I'm on my way home. Yeah, me too. I was supposed to meet Addison 20 minutes ago. Doc Shepard, you're leaving? Uh, I'm also going home. Then go home. Excuse me. Yeah. I didn't think you'd be here today. Yeah, well, I need a neuro consult. Holden McKee, PVS, 16 years. But he was looking at me. He wasn't looking at you. He was. The CT report says he wasn't. Do you want to argue with what I know I saw? No, Meredith. I don't want to argue with you anymore. I gotta go all night. He was looking at you. So, how are you? I'm fine. How are you? Fine. Good. Me and you in this weird limbo. It's gonna go on forever, isn't it? I hope not, but I think so. Yeah, me too. Yeah. I moved Holden to a room on four, so... You lead off all right. Okay. 